Hello there, friends. My name is Adam, and I asked recently on Twitter if people wanted to see some of my old college projects because I found them on my computer. And, uh, yeah. I don't know. This stuff is kind of weird. I only graduated, like, last year in spring, and I got my B.A. in, uh, animation at DePaul University. So, I don't know how many of my projects from then are on here, but there's a good amount. So, let's jump in, and I can, like, give some explanations to, uh, like, the details for the project. So, like, this first one over here, uh, this was an SFM I did where I had this computer monitor using a green screen, and, like, so we wanted to, we had to do, like, a green screen transition effect. Um, and that is the way the news goes, I guess. Anyways, let's jump into that and see how that was. I am good animator, Luke. Solid voice acting. I love how I even like didn't even get the entirety of the green out I now these days animator. with all the experience I've had Luke. I'm able to do that and uh, every shot I had like something change up and be added into I it am good animator Luke. I am good animator look This is like I am good eight or ten seconds Luke. loop every time, so like this probably took like even less than a day. They're looking at the camera now and shit. I am good and <laughs> I'm a funny person. Well, you know, when you have good ideas at the time, you think they're good at the time, then you look back at them, and then you're like, no, this was terrible. And that's just kind of how it is. And it'll always be like that. Um, so this was for a storyboarding class, so, like, I originally drew, I think I might have drawn this up originally, but I wouldn't know where those drawings would be, but I mainly storyboarded it in SFM, I think. So let's see how this was. Yeah, it's just a SFM storyboard. Oh. Who's uh, no! Engineer! <laughs> Look here, pumpkin egg. You're all done. That's shitty posing. <laughs> Just working at SFM. Oh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> you always have to have the twist. People laughed at that bit at the end. Um, I remember, yeah, good times, good times in that class. What's this? Animatic. Is this my animatic for my capstone, maybe? Oh my god, okay, so. I think for this I'll save at the end and like edit it together uh, to have the storyboard. This was with that one Genji animation I put up last year. That was my capstone, so the big projects that we had to work on for six months. So I'll post that up. Um, I'll put that in the end and edit it to be side by side with the original YouTube video so that you all can see like how it looked in storyboarding and then the final product next to each other. Um, what is this even? Oh god, this was the... Alright, so this was for Animation Production 2? Or 3? I think it was 2. And so we had... We were given for that two words. And so mine was like bear and city or something like that. Uh, and we had to make an animation based off of the two words we were given from the hat or bucket, whatever. Um, so at first I was doing this in SFM, and then the teacher was like, no, we kind of have to do our own art style for it, and I'm like, ah, I see. 
So this is what the SFM version looked like. It was like quick 35 second like preview, and it's like storyboarded as well, I think. So it's really shitty and has me terribly voice acting. How's it going, Barry Bear? Oh, Riley Rabbit. This life in the wild is just too boring for me. I want excitement. Why not just live in the city with the humans then? I see a truck over there packing up to head out to the city. I think it's so quiet because, oh, like... You can't just go in there and all that nonsense because, you know, humans don't accept animals as much and it's like, hey! So I think that was, like, really quiet because I was probably recording that, like, one in the morning or some shit and parents were sleeping. So, yeah, not really fun. What's fear? Oh, this was dumb. I used, like, a walk cycle to... Just like, we had to make some dark, shadowy type of deal for an animation in Animation Production 1. Is this the... Okay, no. I don't know if I might have put this up on YouTube, probably not. This is a whip. So it's not even the final version. I had sound and everything in this. Oh, right, this newspaper, like, was going to transform into, like, a picture or a map or something like that. Yeah. And also, I think I changed it to black and white in the end just to make it work, and I'm like, I don't have to care about colors and lighting! And yeah, you couldn't see, like, then you wouldn't be able to see the feet as well? Yeah, okay, that was just a whip. Maybe there's a final on that. Fear. No, that's my final. Oh god, this one. So this was done in After Effects. Uh, I drew the things up in Photoshop, because we had some takes in the classrooms. And I'm a ter at the time I was pretty bad. Right now I'm better, but I'm still pretty bad when it comes to drawing. So I, it, we, it was like the same process with the Baron City thing, where I was given like cat and boat. So I like did something with that. This is terrible. There's a sun in the corner like that. <laughs> oh yeah, there's the laser pointer. <laughs> I'm a violent boy. I oh, the fucking angel cat with the laser pointer. So, I think, hold on, with this one, when he's like running or something. No, originally I had him like, uh, having some little like, you know, circles for arms, uh, but then everyone just kept saying, why does the cat have boobs? And I'm just like, okay, I guess. I think this one took me like four hours to do, just like making all the assets and all of that. That little stupid hoppy hop. Ugh, I love After Effects. Um, oh yeah, this is the burger thing that blew up on YouTube. That was my f final fucking project for college. Insane, isn't it? I got a fucking C for that. Oh, the PSA. So, this was for Animation 1. And, uh... I don't even know what the requirements were. I, I, just some message or something? A PSA message or something? So I use Heavy and my... Hello, I am Heavy Weapons Guy, with the most important news. Tiny baby men on team have been failing on capturing points. But why? Because of anime trash and their waifus! It brings much shame <laughs> to be so stupid. Your waifus are not real. Oh god, I was in Dodger Tail so hard. Mm. But the teacher said that my... Actually, hold on, we gotta go back to that. He said that, like, Hello, he really liked the, uh, transition. Tiny baby here. Man, tiny baby... Tiny baby... Because, man, like... It was either this transition or the one where he rotates back, because there was, like, anticipation. I don't know. He always said that, like, I had really good job with, like, timing for cuts, and I guess it's just I watched a lot of fucking cartoons that I kind of like, yeah, it makes sense to have the cut here. Uh. Oh, yeah, okay, so this is the final, I think. This was the final with the fear. Yeah, amusing shit. It's black and white. 
It's all grainy and shit. Ah! <laughs> There's a screenshot of the fucking cave. <laughs> yeah, this one. It was on both sides because textures are hard, apparently. This music. What the fuck was that sound effect even? I think it was like some Call of Duty music or some shit. I'm an Eggie Lord! That spider, thank fucking god, just had a bunch of uh, <clears throat> built in animations. So that I was able to get the point across. Um. What's this? I don't even want to. This is like whip of that burger video. Maybe it was just like, yeah. Start recording. Can I help the next guest, please? God, this is like uh, hello, storyboards. Sir. What can I get for you? This is what it used to look like. <laughs> I like how the final version came out, and I'm still proud of that video. It was dumb. <laughs> I changed up the medic to be the third guy instead with uh the soldier being the other laughy laugh dude and i think that was good just because the soldier's uh facial expressions were better for laughing um okay so more of my stuff is down here because for some classes it was first name then last name and some was last name first name so this was for an after effects class i took where we had to anthropomorphize uh shape objects um so this was a fun one <clears throat> Most of these are in quick time, so because I was like, you have to have it in dot move format. So he's like playing ball against the wall, and the ball's all stretchy, and he's stretchy boy. <laughs> His little shrinky shrink when he gets upset. Yeah, that little. I like that little jumping. He stretches what the jump like that. I like that a lot. Yeah, just like, oh! It's very slinky-like. So I was, I like that one a lot. Uh, okay, so this was for a 3D class, where we had like three class sessions, so like four and a half hours uh, to work on a thing. So I did, uh, for a character model, just take an existing character from any media and uh, make a 3D model of it that's low poly. So I just did uh, the Skull Kid from Majora's Mask with uh, Majora's Mask. And this was, uh, this was cool. I kind of like this, like, wonky. It looks so bad, but... Because there's just so many things that could have been done. But I think I was, like, limited to some small-ass poly count. That was fun. Oh, this was... So I took a stop-motion class because that was, like, needing animation credits. And I absolutely, to God, hate stop-motion. I love watching stop motion, Coraline, and you know shit like that. Amazing, fucking amazing. Um, but doing animation, um, stop motion is a pain. So this was like I did this in one session, like an hour and a half or something. That was fun. Pain in the ass, but fun. Because we had, like, the nice setup and everything. There was, like, a stop-motion lab. Uh, so we rented that. Like, students would rent that for, like, a few hours for a day. So that was cool. Oh, God. So. Um, no, no, that wasn't for uh, stop-motion class. That was for the same class here. It was, like, animation basics or something. And just, like, giving us a lot of work to do with different styles. So this one was, we had to do like an animation where the characters are puppets and then move them around in After Effects and do something. So this was dumb and I was, nobody fucking laughed. I laughed because that's my type of humor, this stupid ass garbage shit. I mean look at this guy. These guys, I found like the most ridiculous cowboy silhouette like people off of Google Images possible. And I just love this. Like one of them has a damn toy gun and the other has like a realistic looking gun. Ugh. So this is dumb. <laughs> this 
town ain't big enough for the two of us. It's only because we got like three buildings. <laughs> On the count of three. One. Three. What? What you say? Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Man, I had to have been like a. Uh, either a sophomore or junior in college when I did this one. Jesus. 2015, that was three years ago. Yeah, that was like. Fucking. 20. Wow. That was my humor back then. Uh, okay, this was final for 3D class. It was awful. It looks like a goddamn Angry Bird reject. <sighs> I actually show. I actually threw it at Rovio, and they were like, "Cool, show us when it's finished." And I'm like, "I'm not gonna show you when it's finished because it's awful." <laughs> uh, yeah, it looks like something that even God would have rejected. I mean, he made the platypus, and then you have this shit here. It looks like a platypus monkey. I think it, we had to take like multiple animals and combine it to one. So mine was like monkey and like toucan. I remember it specifically being Toucan because I could not do the fucking beak properly and I was upset at myself for that. These textures look like shit. He also looks like he killed me. Ugh. So, this was my... This looks like a better version. This is my... The thing from earlier with the bear and the rabbit. I stylized it into a more like South Parkish uh, paper mache look, I guess. I've been using this type of style for my current work. Um at the company I'm working at as social media gra motion graphics dude person. It says digital media creator on my business card. This is Barry Bear in the big city. So enjoy my shitty voice acting. I'll turn up the volume. How's it going, Barry Bear? Oh, Riley Rabbit. This life just isn't cut out for me. I want excitement. Why not just live with the humans then? I see a truck and ready to out to the city. <laughs> of course, you know, humans don't accept animals and all that nonsense. Might have been due to World War II or something with the Nazi. Hey! I don't where get do you it. think you're going? To the city, of course. I was only joking. Get back here. <laughs> humans don't accept animals. I'll show them. Wanted. Great, I can get a job and fit in. Uh, I don't even know how he knows what a job is. Gosh darn it, Bill. I wish we caught a bear today in the woods. Maybe next time, Terrence. What can I get you guys? <laughs> uh, oh, jeez. I think I left the stove on. Be right back. I think he'll come back. Nope. Oh. <laughs> that was made in a day. <laughs> or two or something like that. I made the assets in one day and animated the rest in one day because I was like push pressed for time because I was like, yeah, don't do it in source. I'm like, mm, we should have discussed this better. I was terrible in some classes. Jesus. I drew those all up in Photoshop and shit. It was still funny. It was terrible, but it's funny. Ah, so some of the animated clips from the Genji thing. Um, anything else? Nope, that's about it. So those are my college projects. And then I'm going to cut from here and we're going to just show off that Genji video again with the uh, storyboard side by side. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And uh, maybe I'll get to work on some other animations in the future, which I'd like to. Right now I'm just doing a bunch. Hello, my student. Would you like to join me for meditation today? If so, come visit me at the temple. Zenyata. Uh, it's always a hassle to get up these stairs. Better run to get there fast. Uh, 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 uh.
Me. 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 Student, you seem to have taken your time. <coughs> Why didn't you just take the elevator? Me.